Hi, this is Dr. Darren Schmidt at the Nutritional Healing Center of Ann Arbor. This video is on how to reverse gout, and it is reversible. So, here's the cause. The cause is dysfunction of the kidneys. Now, the kidneys are supposed to clean out crystals out of the, out of the blood, out of the fluids of the body. And if that is dysfunctional, those crystals stay in the blood and stay in the fluids and then they, go, they circulate around the body, and then they get deposited in joints, especially at night when you're laying in bed. So a lot of people with gout will have pain about an hour or two hours after they're laying down in bed. That's when the crystals are actually depositing because you're laying still in bed. Whereas during the day, you're walking around and you're moving, and you get those, those crystals are like floating around in your body. Okay, so... Um, I drew these kidneys right here just to let you know, um, just, just to you know, talk about the kidneys. So there are triggers for gout that is different than causes. The kidney dysfunction is the cause. The triggers are different for different people. So it could be red meat, it could be wine, it could be white bread, it could be sugar. Okay, so what causes this dis dysfunction of the kidneys? Well, I've pretty much seen it to be, <clears throat> excuse me, to be um, an excess intake of sugar or white refined carbohydrates, grain products, okay, but that's debatable, okay. So here's a joint, and a joint is two bones put together, sometimes there's a disc in between, and then there's this like capsule around it, a ligamentous ligaments holding it together, and there's not much fluid interchange from inside the capsule to outside the capsule, but those crystals can soak in there and um, have a hard time coming out. So gout typically is in the big toes. That's just because of gravity. So the crystals are going down because of gravity. Um, but it could be in the elbow. I've seen it in the elbow, shoulder, hip. Um, and there's uh, the supplements to reverse this are from Standard Process. Our favorite, one of our favorite supplement companies, and one of them is called AC Carbamide. Whoops, C A R B A M I D E. AC Carbamide, and the next one is called Arginex. Okay, so AC Carbamide acts like opening up a faucet, and the fluids just dump out. They can just get cleaned out of the kidneys, and the Arginex is like scrubbing bubbles. And it cleans out the kidneys and the liver and the bladder. Uh, but the point here is to clean out the kidneys. So I had gout in 2007. And my diet's been the same since 2000. I eat meat and vegetables, sometimes fruit for dessert. Um, I haven't purchased a loaf of bread since 2003. And I don't eat sugar. I don't, eat, uh, I don't drink pop. But meat and vegetables, those are my favorite foods. I eat them three times a day. And... So for between 2000 and 2007, my diet was the same. I got pain in my left big toe. I started this supplement right here, and it took a year and a half, and the pain was gone. It kind of came back in 2009 a little bit, so I took a little bit more, and then that's been it. And I haven't had it right now. It's 2015. So, but my diet's been the same for 15 years. So there's no, that's not the cause of it, because if, if the cause was the diet, I would have it right now. But anyway, so I just want to like clarify this idea that, yeah, you want to make sure your diet is really clean, no white bread, no white sugar and all that stuff. Eat, eat good uh, fats and proteins and vegetables. But you could still eat a really good diet and still get gout because of a dysfunction of the kidneys. So there's how to reverse gout. Now, medically, they give anti-inflammatories and painkillers. That's not a cure. Um, there's, uh, there's smarter ways to go about it. So, um, hope this helps. And um, if you need any help, you can contact us.